Next, we've learned just how popular free tuition has become at City College of San Francisco. It's created a sudden spike in enrollment. It jumped nearly 24% over last year. KPX 5's Emily Turner on how they're adjusting to the influx of new students. Emily? Yeah, Veronica, the numbers clearly show a strong response to this program, but it hasn't been without its critics. So here we are on the third day of the first semester, and there are plenty of people watching to see how this goes. It's Rachel Amaya's fifth year at City College, and the changes this semester, she says, are obvious. Longer lines, longer book lines, longer classroom lines, a lot of people asking to try to get in the class more. Um, yeah, I see a lot. And she has City College's free tuition program to thank. The program offers California resident students like her who live in San Francisco free tuition. And they've turned out in droves to claim it. With 4,000 more students this year than last year, there have got to be some growing pains. What are some of the challenges you guys have faced this year from last? Well, as you look around, one of it is parking. So we're trying to fit every car we can. The $5.4 million program is funded by San Francisco's luxury property tax. And so far, it's under budget. But it doesn't come without its criticisms. The college dropped its initial plan to require students to maintain a 2.0 GPA to maintain free tuition. What was the thought process in not having a mandatory minimum grade point average to keep that free city program. Yeah, I think the uh, the goal was accessibility. I think number the number one goal is accessibility. So where does accountability fall in that? Well, accountability is always is built into our instructional programs. It's a work in progress, the chancellor says, and this semester will be a learning experience for administration as well. Policy changes could be in store once they have a better feel for how it all works out. Until then, though, students say the benefits of the program are worth the wait. Now that it's free college, it will help out a lot for people to get better degrees and, you know, more education, try to get better jobs, and I think City College is doing that. City College also hopes that this program is a way to kind of turn a corner and put past financial mismanagement and accreditation crisis in the past. But it's important to note that City College benefits from free city also, not just the students. With each additional student who's enrolled here, they get about $5,000 from the state of California for funding, which they say in budget years to come will be very helpful. Reporting live in San Francisco, Emily Turner, KPIX 5.